So here we are at the uh, uh, Pier Marquette River. You can see the sign says the M37 landing. We're right off M37. And M37 runs north and south up to Traverse City um, and goes down uh, uh, where, our, where we're staying. The RV park that we're staying at, Pier Marquette Oaks, is uh, west of 37, south of this river a couple of miles and west of 37. But we're down at the boat launch and uh, just wanted to take a look and show you for those of you who are uh, canoers or kayakers or fishermen, uh, you can come on down here to the uh, Pier Marquette River and there's a number of different uh, different landings, different boat launches. Pretty uh, quiet and peaceful today. They say it's a great, uh, great trout stream. I'm going to back up the launch here so you can see what it's like. Here we are again on the uh, PM, or the Pier Marquette River, uh, only this time we're uh, up the road at Branch, Michigan. We took 37 north uh, through Baldwin and then turned left on Route 10, um, that's Michigan 10, and that heads uh, toward Ludington. I just wanted to stop in and check out the boat launch and see the river. I think we're going to take a canoe ride sometime this summer down this river. I'm looking forward to it. So Kathy just told me that uh, she's seen two two fish jump out of the river here. It's moving at a pretty pretty good clip. We won't be, uh, if we go canoeing, we won't have to do much paddling. <laughs> We're at the uh, Upper Branch Bridge. It says the next landing is four hours down the, down the stream. be a nice uh, peaceful ride especially nice on a hot summer day we're at another uh, river landing uh, boat launch just to my left uh, down maybe a hundred feet or so and uh, Again, this is the Pier Marquette River. It's flowing pretty good. We had a lot of rain last week and really pretty back here. Kathy's going to go back up the steps and up to the parking area and then we're going to walk over to the boat launch. Just walking through the trail. Heading over uh, toward the boat launch so we can get a little closer down to the water. We're at the boat launch. A little different boat launch than I'm used to seeing. It's, uh, you actually slide your boat down these rails, I guess. For those of you who fish, uh, maybe you've seen this before, but you just back your trailer up to the uh, to the edge of the rails. So you get in the boat and go down. Oh no 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 you don't get in the boat and go down. Slide the boat down. I know, but then you gotta tie it off. Water. Well you tie it off. You can tie it off on that post there. Oh. And then come back up and put your car and your trailer away. 
it'd be a heck of a, heck of a ride if you got in the boat and uh, slid down the ramp. Whee! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm going to walk on down a little uh, closer to the water's edge. Can you hear the water moving? And it's so clear. I mean, you can look out there uh, 20 feet out, maybe, from the edge. It looks like it might be 4 or 5 feet deep out 20 feet, but it's still clear. I can see right to the bottom. And I bet if I could wade out there, I could still see. Oh, yeah, you can see the rocks out there. Halfway out, you can see the rocks. This is so pretty. Go ahead, Kath. Set your butt on the rail and <laughs> slide on down. Yeah. <laughs>